Hello there, what's up guys? Today I'm going to show you how to drop a database um, that is uh, when the user allow that, that drop database is set to false, for example, and then you are unable to drop a database. For example, let's say we want to drop this, we want to drop this database that is game info database. So I go to, I type the SQL command, drop database um game info sorry so this should be all so let's say i want to drop this particular uh, database um okay and then let me just put some notation here so let's say i want to drop this particular database and then when i hit go it says uh drop database statements are disabled so when you when you get such an error it's just very easy to solve it uh, so let's see how we can solve it so the first thing you need to go you need to locate to zam that is uh in my case i have zam under softwares so i just click it zam and then i go to php my admin where it is installed under zam and then go to a folder named libraries so libraries the folder now here you need to identify a php file called config.default so config.default is a php file that has most of your uh, php mysql file, uh, configuration so let me just right click and then open it with notepad plus plus or you can open it with any other editing tool so now here you just need to come here or under this php file and then locate for the place that says allow user drop to drop database so in my case it is located under line 767 yes so it's here so I locate for this line which says allow user drop database which now it is set to false so i now need it to set it to true so that i'm able to drop that uh, particular uh, database that uh, says it can't be dropped which is this one so let me just go ahead and do that sorry so i should be here so i just need to enable it this one to be true so set it to true so once it is true and i save so the next thing you need to do is to save you can save it using Control s or you can save it using the save um, keyword here so once you are done with that now let's go back to the database and let me refresh it uh, let's see what happens so now i want to drop this particular da uh, database which is game info so i type the sql com uh, statements again so drop database and the name of the database here is game info so that's game uh, info and then um, okay since i'm using a dash uh, hyphen or i'm using an hyphen i need to put it under this particular quotation marks so that to allow me to drop it so now once it is this way drop database game info and then let's eat the keyword go now you can see the database has been now successfully dropped so that's how you do it so uh just come to go to exam php my admin and then libraries locate for this file called config.file right click open it with um, any edit um, any software that is any editing software and then once you open the php file go to this particular line which says that is in my case is 767 allow user drop database set it to true if it's false and then you are good to go to drop the database so thank you thank you guys let's meet in the next tutorial in case of any question just link it in the description below so make sure to hit the bell notification and also subscribe thank you guys